I was just reading what was on my screen, so <clears throat> don't mind me being in my car. I am at football practice with my son, and I don't have on any makeup, so thank God for filters, because <laughs> I look a hot mess today. Oh my gosh, the day that we have, that I have had. I have not been home since I left this morning. So, hey Tracy. Oh my goodness. So look, I figured since my other live got deleted, I would pop on here today to answer these questions about, <laughs> thank you. I don't feel it, I do not feel it today because so we are, oh, I miss you too. Oh my goodness. So listen, we're in the process of renovating um, a house that we just purchased and we're moving into um, sometime next week. And y'all, this process, hey boo, <laughs> this process has been so insane. Like, we started January 23rd, and this is May 3rd, and it has been insane. That is why I have been kind of like MIA, but not really, because I'm here, but I'm not really here, and it's, it's just been crazy. So, I am praying. I need some of that natural sunlight. <laughs> I'm praying Oh, Melissa, how are you? I miss you. I love you too. I'm praying that they will finish enough for us to be able to live in the house this week. But everything, where, hold on, where is my child? Because I, whatever, I don't know. Anyway, um, yeah. hey, Naya. Mwah, I love you, Nana. Okay, guys, let me, let me, I'm trying to wave at everybody. Okay, let me do this. All right, so look, so many people have been sliding in my DMs. I wish I knew how, I wish I could share. Boom, look, okay, so this is the first question that I want to answer. Y'all see this thing right here? Um, this is called, so many people have been asking me, what is this? How do I get one? What is this? Okay. So this is the first question I'm going to answer. I hope the video loops. Okay. Perfect. So this right here is a hair injection machine. Now, if you look really, really close, you see that the hair is not being injected into a piece of lace. The hair is being injected into a mannequin. So this is not meant to be used on wigs, all right? Now, there is a bigger version of this that looks like a sewing machine. That's the one that I have. It looks like a big old sewing machine, and it has eight needles, and it injects hair either into thin skin or it injects hair into um, a lace material, and then it's turned on the under, underside, and then there is a uh, type of a liquid that is applied to underneath, which is usually uh, polyurethane, PU, that's applied to um, make it stay. It's another, it's some other stuff within that process, but um, this is the first one that I wanted to answer because so many people have been asking me about this machine. So the other machine, depending on where you get it from, um, the company, I think the company I purchased mine from was Vesta Hair College. It could have been a different company, but I do know that they sell it. Here's the thing though. I purchased mine before the pandemic and it was about $750. However, um, nobody tells you about the, the shipping cost. So when it was all said and done, I paid over $2,000 to get that machine in my house. And then when I got the machine, um, the motor was bad. It was supposed to be brand new, but the motor was bad. So I had to have a brand new motor put on my machine. So um, maybe I'll do a video <laughs> once we get moved into the new house <laughs> to show y'all how it works. Because I haven't used the machines this packed away and it's just not available to be used right now. But that's what this is. So hopefully 
um, this clears up some of the confusion. I saw people asking me, um, hey, can I use this to ventilate lace wigs and all of that stuff? And the answer to that is no. I wish I had a way, a faster way um, to ventilate lace wigs or to tell y'all how to ventilate lace wigs, but this is it. Okay, let me take this off. Let me see. How do I do that? Oh, okay. I like that little thing. So, yeah, that's question number one. Question number two. Uh, that I've been getting a lot is about the live event. So the live event is in Vegas and it is currently available to students of mine, people who have trained with me. It's a three-day live event. It is totally optional and it's separate from uh, Lacewig University. So Lacewig University is all online um, and you have lifetime access to it. The live event is something that I do for those people who want hands-on training. So you get one day of hands-on ventilating right here in Las Vegas, um, and then you get uh, two days of marketing. Marketing is the part that a lot of people don't realize they need because there's so many people, so many talented wig makers and people in other industries who are phenomenal at what they do, but nobody knows who they are because they don't really understand marketing. And so marketing is one of the most critical skills when it comes to being a business owner and owning and being who you are, right? So one of my students, she doesn't make wigs. Well, she's not taking clients anymore. Um, you probably have seen her on my Instagram, Martina Giovanni. She is, um, she was one of my students who she took that training, so there's a training inside Lacewig University called How to Make Your First $10,000 Making Lace Wigs. She made her first $10,000 making lace wigs based off of the marketing strategies that I taught in that one-hour video. So if somebody could take a one-hour video and make their first $10,000 with lace wigs, imagine what you could do with me in a room for two days downloading marketing knowledge into your brain so a lot of people don't know that i i didn't just start making wigs like a year or two ago i've been doing this for a very long time well over 10 years i've uh, been in the industry this year will be 19 years in business um been in the industry longer than that and i've been teaching wigs well over 11 12 13 14 years it's been a very long time Yes, Melissa, it is everything. I'm telling you, listen, if you've never, I I am not one to toot my own horn, but let me say this. I can say this about my live events. If you have never attended one of my live events, you must. It is a must. It's something about those live events that are just amazing. And I can't, I don't credit myself with it. Okay, maybe I do just a little bit, but I'm just kidding, y'all. But the live events are, seriously, they're amazing. Um, a lot of information at the live events. They're <laughs> thank, thank you. Uh, but I'm serious. If you've never attended, and listen, I am considering, I think I'm going to do this, though. I'm considering opening up the event to the public, meaning allowing people to attend that have not um, had any training from me. I just have to figure out the logistics of that. Oh, thank you for the badge. You're so sweet. Um, I have to figure out the logistics and make it, make sure it makes sense to make sure that everybody is getting exactly what they need and more when they, um, when they attend a lot, the live event here in Vegas. So the dates are July 25th through the 27th, um, and it's going to be at the M Resort. Beautiful, 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 beautiful property. Uh, it's going to be at the M Resort, and it's off the strip. So technically, it's on the strip, but it's off the strip. I do that on purpose. I need you to stay focused. <laughs> so I do that on purpose. But I'm telling you, we're going to have, it's going to be a lot of fun you're going to be in uh, the atmosphere and in the room with other wig makers and people who have the same type of interest that you do 
in, in wigs. So it's going to be absolutely amazing. Um, let me see. What is the other question that I keep getting a lot? Oh, my gosh. This is such a common question. How long does it take to make a lace wig? So, oh, this is a good question real quick before I answer that question. Yes, Lillian, I she said I purchased the kit. Do I need what is happening? Hold on, y'all. Why are they moving? Oh, they're moving to the other field because the game is over. Okay, so... Um, I purchased the, the kit. Do I need to bring it with me? Yes. So you uh, the, bringing your tools, you need to bring tools because there's, there's not going to be tools provided. However, if you don't want to travel with your tools, um, you will have the opportunity to purchase a toolkit at the live event. Um, so yes, you will need tools. And once you register for the live event, there is a document that you receive that tells you everything that you need. Um, I actually think that's in your member area, but it tells you everything you need to have for the live event. I just emailed you about the event. I really would like to take a class with you. Amazing. So listen, if you've emailed us in the last couple of weeks during enrollment period, please give us give us grace we have so much going on so many emails and stuff coming in um and my team is working so hard around the clock to get everybody's uh email and dm and text and comment answered so just give us grace okay just give us a um a little bit of extra time you will be responded to okay back to how long it takes to make a lace wig so this is another common question that I get so much. So the time that it takes to make a lace wig is determined by so many different things. The size, the density, the texture, um, the type of hair, and even the type of lace. And I know you're thinking like lace is lace, but that's not true because not all lace is created equal. Um, you have your... Asian lace, which is obviously made in um, Asia. And then you have your other lace. Um, the other lace that I'm referring to is lace that has been used in television and film for literally years. It takes a special machine. Um, I know of two machines currently that exist to make that type of lace that has been used in television and film. And one of the companies that makes the lace is Atelier Arbasi, A-T-E-L-I-E-R-B-A-S-S-I. I, -S -S -I. I, um, th I love their lace. I always suggest to my students to um, purchase their, thank you, my brows. I need to get them um, microbladed again, but I always suggest to my students to order their, um, their lace sample booklet because it has all the lace that they offer. Well, most of the lace that they offer and you can touch it and you can feel it. But what here's what people don't realize. Everybody's like, oh, HD lace, I got HD lace and da 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 All right, let me break lace down to you. There's film lace, there's HD lace, there is base lace. And I'm not going to name all of them. Those are the three main ones. Base lace was also can also be called opera lace, depending on where you're located in the world. So that base lace is a thicker denier of lace. So your denier um, is the weight of the lace. So the higher the number, the heavier the lace. Typically, your higher denier lace, which some people also call base lace, uh, French lace. That's the lace that's a little bit thicker that's used in the parts of the wig that you're not that's not going to be exposed to the human eye. That lace is typically used in the back if it's not going to be pulled up or in the in the middle here, right here. And the holes are the holes in that lace are bigger. Now you have your film lace and you have your HD lace. The film lace is lace that should have always been used in these manufactured wigs however the lace made in asia versus the lace made in switzerland is or whatever country the lace is made at it's not in asia 
um, is totally different. The material used to create the lace is completely different. You can look at it and feel it and tell. And plus, the color is completely off, in my opinion, with um, the some of the Asian lace. So it feels different. And you even have different deniers of film lace. And some of the film lace, and I'm telling you, I tell people all the time, be careful using HD lace because you may not actually need HD lace. You may be able to, to do what you need to do with film lace and it still melt and disappear and do all of that good stuff. HD lace is meant to be used in television and film for like a one-time use, not something to be worn every single day. However, there is... There are different types of film lace and HD lace that you can purchase that has a coating on it to help with durability. And those um, types of lace can be purchased from Atelier Bossy as well. Now know this, I do not get a commission or I don't get money for recommending um, that company at all. I just like their product. Another great company to purchase from is Jagazi Naturals. Uh, she's right here on Instagram. So is um, at Lear Bossy. Um, yeah, so those are two companies that I highly, highly recommend. Um, so there's lace, right? So that's lace. That determines. And, and with the different types of lace, the HD lace, the film lace, and the base lace, guess what? The holes vary in size. So with your film lace, the holes are way smaller than... <laughs> your heavier denier lace and then with HD lace they're even smaller and more fragile than that so if you think about it the 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 amount of holes that you have in a square inch determines your density so if you're working with hair that's very very fine and it needs to be thick you're going to have to use more hair if the holes are a little bit further apart to make that wig as dense as you need it to be so that is a huge determining factor when it comes to the amount of time it takes to make a lace wig. Um, now, texture of hair. Some textures of hair are finer than others. The diameter of the actual strand is finer than other strands, and some are thicker than others. So that determines, too, because let's say you're making a super dense, you need to make a super dense wig with, I don't know, film lace. The amount of hair that you use is going to be completely different, might be completely different using curly hair. Well, it will be completely different if you're using curly hair versus straight hair. All right. So those are just the things that you have to consider when it comes to making a wig from scratch. It's not a one. It's not like one thing where you can say, oh, it's going to take me 36 hours. Well, no, because there's too many things that determine the amount of time it takes to make that wig. All right, so that's one. Um, what did I say? Lace density size. Obviously, the bigger the uh, the bigger the wig you're making, the more hair it's going to take to cover that real estate if your client has a big dome. So <laughs> that's something to consider as well. Um, and that's it. So on average, it takes. Depending on who you ask, I'll give you a range. I'll say from 35 to 70 hours, give or take hours on the front end and the back end. All right, so that is approximately, that's a range of time that it takes to make a full lace wig. However, the thing that I don't want you, I don't want you to stop at thinking, oh my gosh, that's a lot of time. I don't have time to do that because that's the, I see those comments and you got to think outside like Carmelicia says she's one of my students who came back to teach inside Lacewood University she says you got to think outside the wig block and that's actually true because you don't have to just make lace wigs you can do repairs you can do one day wig customizations you can do all kinds of things you can just make those patches those invisible hair patches I can make an invisible hair patch, the small ones, like the little quarter size ones in about an hour, if that. All right, so there are so many other things that you can do with the skill of ventilating. And then of course you can take what you make, what you learn with making lace wigs 
and create so many different things. The possibilities are endless, like seriously endless. So it's a lot that you can do with it. But that's a very, very common question that I get. How long does it take to make a lace wig? So there, that was a somewhat of an answer. It was a long answer. Uh, Quantum Leap says, I paid for the live event, but I haven't booked a hotel or flight. We'll be coming from London. Wow. Oh my goodness. I think, I think I have not, um, finalized anything yet, but I think, um, I'm going to have a volunteer here, uh, from London. So we'll see, but wow, that is amazing. I can't wait to meet you. Um, okay, let me see. I'm just going through film lace and she lace one time base lace. Okay, good. You were taking notes. Thank you. Thank you for the info. You're welcome. Didn't catch the spelling of that company. I know I said it so fast. So at Lier, A T E, they're here on Instagram. Tell them I sent you. A T E L I E R. You better catch that ball. That's my boy. A <laughs> T E. L-I-E-R, Bossy, B-A-S-S-I. Uh, they're right here on Instagram. I'm a football mom, y'all. Okay, yes, Jagazi. You know what? I think sh she actually changed her Instagram name. I think it's Jagazi Naturals still. Oh, perfect, perfect. So it is. Nice. You guys are so awesome. I'm just coming through here trying to wave at everybody jagazi okay j-a-g-a-z-i natural perfect 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 okay so listen while i'm answering these questions if you have questions just drop them in the chat okay okay perfect i think i've waved at everybody hopefully i didn't miss anything all right so let me see. That was two questions. I think I did two, one or two questions. I don't know. So, uh, hello, I'm going to DM you. I have questions about Vegas. Okay, cool. Are you going to have an in-person class? Yes, that's what Vegas is. So Vegas is the first in-person class. Actually, it's not the first because I did have one in-person class in 2020, but it was at the very, very end of 2020. Um, so it'll be the second in-person class that I've had since COVID. Um, it's going to be, it's just going to be a whole lot of fun. A whole lot of fun. Thank you. Thank you, Nina. Atli Arbasi and Jagazi Natural. Thank you so much, Nina. So, yeah. So at that event, it's, it's, it's going to be one full day of hands-on, um, like a full day of ventilating, uh, learning different ventilating techniques. I'm probably going to, um, going to teach if you guys saw on my Instagram. Well, since I, well, let me see, can I pull that up? I don't know. Let me see. If you guys saw on my Instagram, I was ventilating a piece of thin skin. Um, I think I'm going to just demo that live at the live event. And here it is right here. Yeah. That's it. So that thin skin situation so somebody asked me the other day, um, does it come in different colors and all of that? And the answer is yes, it comes in multiple colors. All right. The company that I purchased it from is, and see, this is, some of you are new to, to me and you haven't met me before, um, but you've seen my videos and all of that stuff. Here's what you need to know about me. I don't hold back information. I'm not a hoarder of information. So I love to share. So I'm about to tell you where I got it from. 
Vesta Hair College. So that's what I, that that's right. That's I did get my machine from there, my hair injection machine, because I also ordered the thin skin from them. So Vesta Hair College, they have an Instagram, but the best mode of contact with them is through um, WhatsApp. I had a brain thing going on. So the best mode of contact with them is through WhatsApp. And excuse me, you can buy the thin skin through them. It comes in different colors. Oh, excuse me. And it comes in different is it densities? No, it's not densities. Thicknesses. That's not even a word, but y'all know what I mean. Um, they have dark, they have medium, they have light, they have um, different colors, and it comes on a roll like lace. Um, I have a literal, huge, massive roll of this stuff at my house right now. So, um, But that's where I purchased it from. It's easy to ventilate. Um, you just need a, a, a thicker needle. If you're going to do it, and you're going to use the medium thickness material, get you a larger needle. So get like a three, four size needle because the small ones, the barb can break um, a little bit easier because you're going through the material and the material is not, um, it's not like going through lace. It's totally different. Uh, AJ, hey AJ, how are you? How can I avoid the bending of bundles in the wig cap what do you mean how are you attaching them are you using the sewing machine or are you hand sewing them down uh tim says when is the class the class is july 25th through the 27th of this year hey okay i see new people joining um for the skin, Vesta Hair College, what's up? Nina, you are just bomb. Thank you so much. You ever done Beyonce's hair? No, I've never done Beyonce's hair or wig. Um, hello, hello. Yeah, on the sewing machine. So here's the thing. On the sewing machine, there's a bunch of different factors. So if you're having bunching or bending, you might be putting too much tension on either the cap or you're pushing it through as you're sewing and you have to let it you have to just let it do what it does and just guide it don't pull don't tug just guide it and don't try to try to pull it um but you'll have to dm me um aj dm me what type of machine you're using and a video of the issue that you're having and i can diagnose better if i see it but it's probably just a tension issue you probably are pulling it too tight and you cannot you can't pull it or it could be the type of cap you're using too so dm me and i can try to diagnose from there uh what would someone that knows nothing about wig be of course yes that is such a great question you need absolutely no experience whatsoever. Uh-oh, wait a minute. Am I good now? Am I good? Okay. You need absolutely no experience whatsoever, not even an ounce. So, so many of my students, even the, the young lady that I talked about earlier when I just popped on here, um, uh, Martina Giovanni, that's her name on Instagram, she did not have any experience with ventilating at all. And in 18 months, um, she went from having no experience ventilating to making her first $10,000 with lace wigs. So you don't need to know anything. When I tell you <laughs> I am very thorough, it is very 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 thorough so the first portion so it's broken up into four phases phase one which has already started class technically started on may 1st what that means is phase one was already unlocked so phase one is the lace week training system where you get to go through the entire course of me teaching you my approach to making lace wigs from start to finish you go you have 30 days to go through the whole thing 
um, after that 30 days, you're still going to have your access. You have lifetime access to everything. So if life happens, if something happens and you have to stop going through everything, it's okay. You can pick up where you left off at. It's totally fine. I'm not going to revoke your access or anything like that. So you have 30 days to go through the entire Lace with Training system. And then um, after that 30 day mark, the very next day, your mentorship program starts. And that is phase two. So in the Lace Week Mentorship Program, um, you go through, that is broken down into three months. So the first month is all about you making your first project. So you're going to make a closure from start to finish. I'm going to teach you how to make the closure, how to make the, 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 the template for it and everything. All right, you'll go through that entire process and you spend one month working on your first piece. I was completely blown away by my last class completely blown away their work was absolutely amazing in fact aj was one of those students look let me show oh i like this little feature hold on let me show y'all this is a young lady right here from my last class look at this this is her closure that she made isn't that beautiful absolutely beautiful all right this is the closure that she made um, and she sent me, she actually sent me this video. She was like, I just want to thank you so much. I finally finished. She didn't finish with everybody else. She fell behind, but she still finished. And she sent me this video. I love, I love it. I love seeing stuff like this. So that's phase two. So phase two is your mentorship program. Month one is you make your first closure from scratch. Uh, month two is all about marketing. Remember I talk about marketing it's so important that you understand marketing so you can understand how to effectively communicate what you do to the people who can potentially buy what it is you're selling. Um, and then the third month is all about mindset because you can't put lipstick on a pig, right? You, you have to understand the importance of having the right mindset when you're going into business. So that is the mentorship program. That is phase two. And then phase three that's when all of the bonus content unlocks where I teach you how to make wigs on the sewing machine with the industrial machine and two of the traditional machines. Um, the how to make your t first $10,000 making lace wigs. I show you how to work with insurance companies. I flew in instructors literally from all over the world to teach inside Lace Wig University. Uh, two, I flew in from London. One, I flew in from New York. Tamika Gibbs in the hair diagram. She is an instructor inside Lace Wig University and two of my students, uh, three actually, three of my students. And that is phase three. All of your bonuses unlocked. And then after that, um, in phase four, you have 30 days to go through all of that. But again, you have lifetime access. But the next phase doesn't unlock, which is your last phase until after you, you the 30 days. And so in that last phase, that is when you're... Um, graduation seal unlocked so you get a seal a code to put the seal on your website saying that you're a graduate of lace Week university and you also get to take the test to get your certificate and that's it and then of course you have the option to come out here to vegas for three days uh for the live event that is totally optional it is not a requirement um but you can go from knowing absolutely nothing about lace wigs to knowing absolutely almost everything <laughs> everything not almost everything about lace wigs in this program okay aj great 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 how to get ticks for your live event i want to be there uh tim shoot me a dm shoot me a dm um i didn't hear where to get the thin skin vesta hair college um i think i think they're on here as vesta hair hey carmelisha Carmelisha is one of the instructors inside um, Lace Wig University, and Carmelisha is going to be here volunteering. Hey, you're enrolled. Go ahead, D. Yes, I'm super excited. The wig architect, Nina says, I can attest to having no experience about ventilating. I learned so much from Marquette's tutelage. Blessed hands. Thank you so very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Right? It was so nice. Yes, Carmelisha, the knots were just everything. I mean, everything. Oh, AJ's thanking you, Carmelisha. That bonus was amazing. So 
Car oh, perfect. So, Tim, shoot me a DM and I'll make sure you get the link to go ahead and grab your ticket. Listen, there's two tickets. There is a um, general admission ticket. Listen, y'all, it's only $49. It's not expensive at all. It's only $49 to attend the live event. And that's just a small registration fee. If you want VIP, um, it's $199 for VIP. Uh, there's a private Q&A and all kinds of things. You get a swag bag and special seating if you're VIP. So those are the two options uh, to attend. And that's the student pricing for people who are students of Lacewig University. Um, so it's not expensive at all. I am too, Tim. I'm super excited. I'm very, very, very excited. Vesta Hair College is on here right now. Shout out to you guys. You guys are awesome. You provide amazing things to the wig community. Can you say yes? Because last time, y'all just don't know. I was so frustrated with the last live that I had that did not save. So, yes, I will. I am ready to. Will you ever do a live event in NYC? The short answer is yes. I actually will be doing another live event in New York. I just don't have dates for that yet. <laughs> I won't release dates for any other live event until after the, the Las Vegas event. I want to focus on that event. Greetings from China. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I want to focus on that live event first. But yeah, I'll be back to New York. I actually had an event in New York um, right before COVID. I think it was maybe in 2019. It was 2018 or 2019. And it, it was amazing it was amazing it sold out so i'm ready to come back i'm very ready to come back i would like to attend but i do male hair replacement use it say less say less because guess what there's a whole bonus inside lace wig university just devoted to working with uh we call it man weave <laughs> so there's a whole bonus in there dedicated to that i've always i've always been interested in ventilating for hairlines there's a bonus in there for that too. I'm telling y'all, everything is inside Lacewood University. Literally everything. Everything. Okay, I think I'm going to sign off now. And um, I will be sure to save this live. I am going live again, actually. I have a live schedule for Friday at around, I think it's 4 or 5 o'clock. Um, where I'm going to be teaching how to make those invisible hair patches because they're so easy. I mean, so easy. Yes. Yes, Missy the stylist. I hope I said your name right. What's up, sis? How are you? Thank you, Vesta Hair College. Thank you so much. I, re I sent you guys a message, Vesta, on uh, Vesta Hair College on... Oh, where did I send it? WhatsApp. Because I'm looking for... I don't know the name of this thing. It's 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 the yellow thing that people are using to create the mold and the tape. But I sent y'all a message asking if you carry it and if you do, what is the name of it? Because so many people are asking. And if you do carry it, number one, I want to buy one. But I want to make sure that I share uh, that information on my page with my followers. So let me know if you guys carry that machine and... Um, We'll go from there. I hope y'all do. I hope y'all do. Y'all know which machine I'm talking about? Hold on. Let me show y'all because y'all know I like this feature. So let me see. Let me see. I know I still have the video. This machine right here was well, not even a machine. It's, it's a thing. I don't know what it's called, but I need one. I need one. So if y'all carry that, please let me know. Best of Hair College so that I can purchase one and share the information with all of my followers. All right. I'm going to... Oh, 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 yes. Y'all see that? Ah! <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, good. Okay, so you guys have it. I'm definitely going to purchase one or if not one, more than one. And I need to share that information with all of my followers. So... I'm so glad. I'm so glad you are on here. Yes. Ask and you shall receive. Exactly. Seek and you will find. Knock and the door. Don't make me start preaching on here today. I'm not on here for, <laughs> for that. <laughs> 
But okay. All right. I'm going to sign off for real. I know, right? Hey, I'm due. I missed my um, God Works show this week. I had to play a replay because I had a delivery coming into the house. My husband has called me twice. So let me get off this live. Okay, so New Times Hair has it too. Okay, let me get off get off this live. I'll be live again probably tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know what time or anything like that. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me for these few minutes. I love each and every one of you. I will be sure to save this live. God bless and good night.